I know me as an HR professional and as a financial professional, when I was in corporate America, this would be very important to me. Being able to um, take those self-operating principles and use it as a standard. Can you give me an example of something like if I was having a conflict within my office that I could use one of those principles? Absolutely. One of our all-time favorites is uh, Code 2, uh, the purposeful pause. Uh, we love that one so much. Uh, and most of the codes are very easy to remember. We're very intentional with that. Mm -hmm. uh, they're practical but powerful. The purposeful pause is a very good one because you can practice it right uh, all throughout the day. And what is the purposeful pause? It is just being very intentional about putting space in between your responses. Mm -hmm. Because when you study an emotional intelligence, we realize that when emotions are high, logic will be the lowest. And since we are committed to never letting our emotions overpower our intelligence, that's the why behind the purposeful pause. Whenever we're taking a purposeful pause, we're giving logic time to catch up with our emotions. And what does that mean? I feel like saying something that's probably not gonna land right, but I know if I pause and give myself a moment for the emotions to come down, then wisdom will kick in and I'll say the most appropriate thing um, instead of the thing that first came to mind when I was emotionally charged.